Focus brings success. On a sunny morning, a cute little orange cat named Tom was spending happy time with his mother. The cute Tom has a lot of curiosity, and his eyes are always full of lively light. On this day, my mother decided to train Tom to catch mice. While Tom listened attentively to his mother's teachings, he glanced at the dandelions floating next to him and at the same time noticed the birds flying in the sky. Okay, now you have a try, Mom said with a smile. Tom saw a mouse and started chasing it. But his attention was still distracted by other things. He looked at the birds in the sky for a while and at the dandelions falling everywhere, but the mouse escaped easily. Seeing the mouse escape easily, Tom felt a sense of disappointment in his heart. His little face was full of confusion. He stood there stunned, and the mouse jumped into the hole, then stuck out its little head and raised its eyebrows at him teasingly. The mouse escaped right under his nose, but he was unable to do anything, which made him feel frustrated like never before. The originally playful little eyes were now filled with tears. He lowered his head and looked at his little paws, feeling a little at a loss. Seeing Tom, who had never experienced failure, look so depressed, my mother felt sorry for him. But she knows that this is also the only way for Tom to grow up. Mom has been watching Tom's actions. She noticed that when Tom was chasing the mouse, his eyes were always wandering, sometimes staring at the sky, sometimes staring at the dandelions at his feet. She understood that Tom's problem was that he was distracted and did things half-heartedly. Mom gently stroked Tom's head and said lovingly, When Mom saw you chasing the mouse, your eyes looked here and there. Do you know what this means? That's why you didn't catch the mouse. Whatever you do, you have to do it wholeheartedly and don't do it half-heartedly. His mother's words were full of deep care and instruction, and Tom's eyes revealed seriousness and concentration. He stood up straight, looked into his mother's eyes, and nodded. After listening to his mother's teachings, he now understands that he used to be half-hearted and easily distracted, which was the reason for his failure. Determined to change, Tom started training to catch mice again. He was focused on nothing but the mouse. His attention was focused on the mouse, as if the dandelions around him and the birds in the sky didn't exist. He approached the mouse cautiously, trying not to make any noise or scare the mouse. Then, he gathered enough strength, jumped suddenly, and landed accurately next to the mouse. The mouse was stunned for a moment, and Tom took the opportunity to pounce on the mouse and successfully caught it. At that moment, Tom was so excited that his tail was raised, and his mother also smiled happily. Tom successfully caught the mouse when he was concentrating, and he experienced the joy and sense of accomplishment of doing things wholeheartedly. After that, Tom became a good and focused child. He was no longer as half-hearted as before, and he was always able to complete his work and tasks well. Mom and friends around me are very proud of it.